So as we begin our meditation with a deep, deep breath, and let's, um, as much as we breathe in that wonderful pressure and let all this oxygenation of our cells and tissues happen, let us actually put an emphasis on the out breath As we breathe out, we release everything that we are holding on to that need not be there. Much of the breath is knowingly lead, releasing that need not be there, but there is beneath all that, there are layers of matter, of thought, of energies, that we don't even realize that we hold on to, that will sometimes bog us down. So let's create that intention of, as I breathe out, I'm releasing not only matter from my body that no longer needs to be there, but also my beliefs, my perceptions, judgments that I may have held for so long and that have become such a part of me that I don't even realize it's there till something unhappy, unpleasant happens, like hitting a toe on the corner of the wall, where we have forgotten that the wall was there all along. So just conscious deep breathing and conscious deep releasing of the breath. And you might even slow that release down a slightly longer than the in-breath. As it scoops up from the lower regions of our lungs, that which has sort of sat there, and didn't get a chance to meet up with the fresh air unless we have been exercising vigorously, walking, running, or swimming. And when we become a little more sedentary, then it needs a little extra awareness to soften and melt and let go. And in the next few breaths, let's set the intention of releasing opinions. These are in the mental body, the energetic body that are connected to the solar plexus that we have created mainly for our own ease of passage for our safety our opinions really create the pathway for us to navigate through we are familiar with this don't go there it's not an easy path 
don't face such a situation. It will bring up unpleasantness. Avoid such and such a person. They are full of dense vibrations that will trigger us. These have been extremely useful. And so we're going to just acknowledge that we set these up for purposes of efficiency. So that we can go about our lives, about our business, about our days, without unnecessarily having to deal with unpleasantness, having to deal with energy drains, and it served us well. But we're also going to keep a little space around our opinions, that sometimes it blocks our growth, Because in dealing with those challenges that come from beyond our opinions, that come from the spaces of unknown, that we expand, that we examine those beliefs that we have adopted long ago. So let's go ahead and take a nice deep breath all the way into our lungs, into our body. Because everything that happens in life, ultimately we embody it. Good, bad, indifferent, however we judge it, it finds a spot. And through our deep breathing, through our conscious releasing, we soften those areas that have become hardened. Allowing space for different opinions, different ideas, alternate viewpoints. And giving us time to consider them. Deep, deep breaths. So when we are faced with something not so pleasant, instead of immediately deciding on how to deal with that, how quickly we can push it away, how efficiently you can return and move further. We're going to slow that process down just a little bit and take that breath to make a little extra space. Our minds are astonishingly ingenious and has the capacity to create new pathways, new neurological connections when we take the time 
the breath, the space. As we do this, as we take these considered breathing, we are reminding our body-mind system that not everything is hard and fast. That within this body, within this mind, within this emotional responses, we can create space for a greater universe. for healing of wounds that we may have held for a long for long within our system without realizing and releasing all that slowly gently completely giving more space to that next new breath. Bringing in the life force knowing that every breath keeps us in complete alignment with the highest purpose that we have come here to serve. And sometimes when we feel that we've lost that direction, all we need to do is release some old patterns, some old beliefs, some old walls that we have created. And as we do, we receive the new and the fresh and the expansion of the growing universe within us, around us, for us, and for everyone who is in my life at this time. Deep, deep breath. And deep, deliberate release. And once again, before we come back to this space, And whenever we feel ready, you can open your eyes. <laughs>